Hello and welcome to Maritime African News 77, your weekly news update of the maritime sector in Africa. Here are the highlights of the last seven days. From last Tuesday to Wednesday was held online because of the COVID, the 11th edition of Maritime Week Africa. During the two days event, several high-level speakers from different parts of the world followed one another to expose the latest developments of the sector in different parts of the continent and talk about topics such as maritime transport and energy, insecurity in the Gulf of Guinea, etc. If you have registered for this event and missed some presentations, keep in mind that you can still watch all of them for the next six weeks. Maritime Information and Intelligence. Here is a topic of a training seminar organized by the Institute of Interregional Maritime Security, ISME, for four days for participants from 12 West African countries. It was an opportunity for them to discuss very important topics that contribute to securing the maritime routes of the Gulf of Guinea region. Last Wednesday, the NATO Southern Hub supported by three stones international organized a webinar under the term gulf of guinea improving maritime security during this several representatives of different institutions and experts on the issue presented their views on how best to improve security in this area which has experienced an explosion of piracy activities in recent years this week also witnessed the opening ceremony of a two-week workshop on Yaoundé Architecture Information Sharing Platform Yaris at the headquarters of the Multinational Maritime Coordination Center, MMCC Zone F, in Accra, managed by the ECOWAS and led by Commandant Benin. It was an opportunity for the Gogin team and the staff of the MMCC Zone F to make demonstrations on the use of the Yaris platform. This ceremony was chaired by the Director General of the Maritime Authority of Ghana, Mr. Toma Kofi Alonzi, and was attended by several officials of the national and international maritime community. Thank you for watching us. You can have more of the Maritime News in Africa on our website, www.maritimeafrica.com and our various social networks. Excellent week to you and see you next Monday for another highlight of Maritime News in Africa.